So this first sheet is about the product life cycle. If you can remember, dig my dog, where D is development, I is introduction, G is growth, M is maturity, and D is decline. So dig my dog. You'll also find on the end there's I, and the I is on there for incremental change. First of all, let's look at each of the sections. So development starts off with the product being developed in exactly the same way that you have developed your products. Then it gets released on sale, it gets introduced. Sales increase, it gets to a certain point, that's called maturity, where no more sales will increase. Then afterwards, the product goes into decline. It's the sales that go into decline, not the product itself. So if we have a look at this first part on here, you can see that in development, there are no sales. It gets introduced, sales increase, sales grow, mature, and then go into decline. What you'll notice on this particular diagram on here, when you've got the I for an incremental change, that might reinvigorate sales. You will be asked to support your work with diagrams. So a diagram like this, where you've got dig my dog, with sales on the left hand side, and then have the full words on there rather than D-I-G-M-D, a reminder of the full words, it's development, introduction, growth, maturity, and decline. Let's have a look at some of the reasons for decline. Maybe there's a scandal in the company, for example, something like Starbucks, where they have got caught not paying their taxes. Maybe there's some sort of scandal which the chief executive is involved in, or if you took a scandal, for example, like the Volkswagen, where they forged the emissions tests. There might also be a competitive product which has come along. Also, the product might be too expensive compared to others because other people might be lowering their prices. Therefore, sales will go into decline. Other thing that might change is new technology. So new technology might come along, which means that your product is no longer competitive. Or maybe there's just a change in the climate. For example, if you are selling something like umbrellas, you're not going to sell many during the summer. The next slide we're going to have a look at is incremental change. Tune in for part two.